there are times when plain prayer plain praying baseline praying may fail to achieve the desired result you have followed that that, that process and it looks like the results delay in coming what do you do at such times what to do is to shift levels what to do is to intensify or amplify prayer effort you intensify you amplify prayer effort with other spiritual and scriptural actions that you are that is you are praying but you are intensifying the prayer with other spiritual and scriptural actions what do you do at such times you follow the pathway and the result has delayed you boost your prayer effort with complementary spiritual actions actions that complement the prayer now what are those actions that can intensify or amplify or boost prayer effort number one actions that can intensify amplify or boost prayer effort number one is praying with vision praying with vision praying with vision is praying with a clear picture of desired outcome what is praying with vision first it is praying with a with a clear picture of the desired outcome what is praying with vision it is praying with the end in mind Second, it is praying with the end in mind. What is praying with vision? It is praying with thought. It is praying with clarity and certainty. That is what you are praying about is clear to you. That is, you are not vague. You are not theoretical. What is praying with vision? Thought. It is praying with the reality in your mind before it becomes reality in your life. The reality is in your mind before it becomes reality in your life. You are not just praying for the husband. The picture of the husband is in the mind. While you are praying, you are seeing your wedding. You are seeing your wedding occasion. While the prayer is in your mind, you are seeing your child dedication. It is by the power of positive scriptural imagination. You are seeing it. Abraham, God told him, now you have examples in scripture. In Genesis chapter 13 verse 14 to 15. God asked Abraham, and the Lord said unto Abraham, after Lot was separated from him, lift up now thine eyes and look from the place where you, where you are. Northward and southward and eastward and westward. For all the land which thou seest, to thee will I give it and to thy seed forever. You are praying with a clear picture Abraham you want me to give you the land see it first it is it is when you see it that I can give it 